Hello, I am uh, Dr. Kamerkar, uh, head of the Department of uh, Vascular and Endovascular Surgery at uh, Ruby Hall Clinic, Pune. And I have been practicing vascular surgery for the last uh, 25 odd years uh, purely. Uh, today's topic is what are the treatment options uh, for deep vein thrombosis. Now, deep vein thrombosis is basically developing blood clots uh, into the deep venous system of primarily in the legs. Uh, and what is the risk involved with that? Uh, sometimes these clots which are formed in the legs can go up into the lung circulation and can be fatal as well. So one has to be extremely careful uh, that DVT or deep vein thrombosis is treated very early. So treatment of deep vein thrombosis primarily requires blood thinning uh, injections and later on uh, with the tablets. The earlier therapy of deep vein thrombosis many years ago, I'm talking about 25, 30 years ago, even more, used to be injections called as heparin and they used to come as uh, unfractionated. Later on, uh, you had low molecular weight heparin injections uh, to keep the blood thin. Uh, the effect of heparin essentially was to prevent uh, embolism uh, uh, of these clots into the uh, lung circulation. That means the clots moving into the lung circulation which were prevented by uh, giving these heparin injections. And then uh, subsequently over after injection therapy, the, there was a drug therapy, so drug what is called as a warfarin or coumarin derivatives were used to keep the blood thin. The problem with this uh, molecule was uh, patients required regular monitoring of their uh, what we call as a prothrombin time and INR, which would tell us how thin is the blood. And if the blood is thick, the, the dose needed to be adjusted. If the blood is thin, the doses need to be reduced. Uh, Practically speaking, these were quite difficult in many of the patients, especially coming from the small villages and towns, who didn't have these facilities. And many times patients had a, a side effect of increased bleeding sometimes in the brain and had strokes.